This lesson, I'm going to be showing you how you can add a customized UI item into the menu. And this particular one, when it gets clicked, it's going to have a custom menu and it's going to add the date into whatever the cell that's selected. So we can go in and we can add the date and whatever cell that's in, it's going to go ahead and it's going to add in the date into the cell. And that's going to run the function called adder, which is going to select the spreadsheet, the active range, get the current date and set the value within the cell of the current date. Go ahead and open up a spreadsheet and under the extension select app script that's going to open the app script editor and here we're going to add in a function this function is going to be the on open so whenever the document gets opened we're going to run this function and this is going to be selecting the ui menu from the spreadsheet app service get the ui object and this is going to create it as an object usable format and then fear we can use the ui and we can create a menu for the UI and this will just be whatever custom you can give it whatever name that you want uh, this is just for the label of the menu and then adding in the subsequent items so here you can add items into it by doing an add item and this is just going to add the date to whatever cell that we're in and then we need to also indicate the function by a string value and then once we've ready and once we've created all the items into the UI menu we just add it to the UI and then the next function is going to be the one that's going to correspond to the name the string value here that we have for the function so this is one is going to be called adder and for now what we'll do is we'll select the spreadsheet app we're going to get the UI object and then from there we're going to add in an alert so this will just have a pop-up alert that will say you clicked it and then we'll add the date functionality afterwards. So once you've added this, go ahead and run that. And we want to add it into the spreadsheet. So you can either open and close the spreadsheet or you could run it manually. And let's go ahead and we're going to reopen the spreadsheet. So we just refresh it. So this would run the script and that adds our custom menu. And then here we can select the add date. So the script is running and it shows that we clicked it. So going back into the editor, now let's finish off customizing the script where we're going to be adding in the ability to add the cell date range. So selecting from the sheet. So we're going to just hide that you clicked it pop up and select the sheet object. And we can do this using the spreadsheet app service. We get the active spreadsheet. So that's this one here. And we want to get the active sheet so it's going to select the sheet that's currently active. And then we want to also select the range so that we can write to that area. So from the sheet object, we get the active range. So that's wherever the current sele selected cell is. We want to get whatever the current date is. So create a variable for that. And that's going to just return back the new date object. And then within the range, we want to set a value and it's just the one single value that we're going to be adding in and this value is going to be the current date value that we just pr provided so now we can go into the spreadsheet we can select any one of the cells under the custom menu and run the script and that will add in whatever the current date is you can also update this uh, so that's so you can add in the current date and have the ability to customize an item into the menu, run the script and add the date in. And that's going to work across any one of the cells. So if you do have uh, additional cells here that uh, you go into the different spreadsheets, it will add in the date into these as well.